Okay, let me first say that a hooch date, a hooch date is a hooch update. A hooch date is not a date with a loose woman. Okay, I think I need to, that's a whole nother channel, a whole nother <laughs> YouTube channel. This is a hooch date, but it's not that, that kind of hooch date. Just want to make that clear. My wife told me I couldn't do that. She was explicit about that. Hooch date to follow. Here we go. Here we go with the hooch date. Okay, quick update on the hooch. I noticed the lids are buckling. Right here and here. And as I remember it last year when I took them out, some of the lids had buckled. So I'm not that concerned about it. What uh, what I did last year was just to go straight from uh, putting it in the jars to the ice chest, the the cooler, and uh, you know burying it in the cooler basically. And this year, <coughs> well, I left, left it out on the counter for uh, actually two or three days, I guess. We heard them in there popping, so. Anyway, I don't think it's a big deal because if I, again, as I remember last year, they did it, but it was unseen to me because they had already been put away. So, uh, <clears throat> I did 18 more, which gives me 24 total. I'm going to have to put them in uh, one of these totes, and uh, so they're not going to be actually in an ice chest, just one of these little Rubbermaid totes because I've got a bunch of those, but I don't have, but... Uh, I don't have enough ice chest to put these in because <clears throat> there's 24 of them and these are pretty good sized jars. So I'm going to put them in those and uh, put some soil over them, or potting soil or something over them. Uh, I just got to thinking uh, something like uh, oil dry would be good. But, uh, you know, whatever you use, potting soil, whatever, reuse it. I mean, I took the potting soil out of that and just put it in the, uh, out of the ice chest when I got these out and put, them, put it in a tote and I, I planted all my plants this spring in it. So. Uh, you know, wh whatever you use, understand it's going to do double duty. You could put uh, probably oil dry in it and you know, bury them in oil dry and still use the oil dry later. Also, I believe I'm going to go back on the 18 that I did that I just finished because they hadn't really started swelling yet or doing anything. I'm going to loosen the cap just a little <clears throat> and I'm going to just go down until I f first feel the cap touch and uh, or the, the, the ring. Uh, when I first feel it touch and maybe just you know maybe another quarter inch or something just barely in other words you give it just a little room to expand if it needs to that may not be a good idea because it may uh, it may want to expand I mean it may want to shoot some some of the juice and stuff out of this it may lose, lose some of the juice in this in this manner you're you know you're buckling the lid which is not a big deal you're gonna throw the lid away anyway like I told you it's gonna get rusty but um, uh, I, don't, I don't know I'll send it down I won't set it down quite, probably quite as tight as these, but uh, <clears throat> a little bit. And then I'm going to come back in a couple of days and check them and see if they're doing the same thing. Shouldn't be a big deal. And uh, But like, like I say, last year, the, the ones last year, uh, many or all of them, I really don't remember, but I know some of them had buckled like this. Just want to let you know, in case you start buckling and you freak out, don't do it. Uh, anyway, I think, I think that's about it. We're gone.